Hello and welcome to the Mirror's Guide to the news that inflation hit 9% today. We will explain what that means, but more importantly, what that means for you. So today, the Office for National Statistics said that inflation has risen to the figure of 9%. To put that in context, it's the highest figure in 40 years and very close to a record high. When inflation rises, it simply means that the price of goods and services is going up. So for example, if something cost £1 a year ago and inflation is 9%, the same item will cost £1.09 today. This doesn't apply across the board, it is an average figure. So some items will increase by more than 9% in price, some less, and some can even fall in value. It works out at a 9% rise overall. A big part of that 9% increase is down to the soaring cost of energy bills, which are part of the sums done to work out the overall inflation figure. This is obviously bad news for UK households who are going through a cost of living crisis combined with wage increases, generally speaking, far below 9%. It means if your salary hasn't kept up with inflation, which is the case for most workers, you will find that your household finances are squeezed. That's because as prices rise on food, energy and fuel, our earnings aren't keeping up and we will start to struggle with money. Rising inflation also erodes the value of any savings you may have. Some bad news is that inflation is due to hit or exceed 10% this year, according to the Bank of England. Some slightly better news is that government is talking about making more payments to households to help with the cost of living, but nothing has yet been confirmed. Already, government has given a £200 payment per household to help with energy bills. This is being administered through energy providers. Unfortunately, this is a loan, a form of loan, that will need to be repaid over five years. There is also a £150 council tax rebate if you live in a council tax band A to D. If you're struggling to pay your bills, there is help available. Charities like Citizens Advice and Step Change can help, especially if you're worried about debt. Alternatively, you can speak to your energy provider, water company, bank, whoever it might be that you owe money to if you're in financial trouble, and ask what help is available. You may find that they can offer a form of repayment plan, advice, and sometimes even grants.